We're here tonight at Blackpool for the switch on of the 2022 Illuminations. Are you excited, Sophia? Yeah. Yeah, we see the Illuminations most years, but we've never seen a switch on. We was here a couple of years ago, November 2020, when the lights got switched off, like for the first time outside their normal schedule. You can check out that in the description down below. It was a re really eerie night. We pretty much completely missed 2021, but we're back tonight. And we're I used to come and see them when I was little, so, but I've never seen them switched on, so it's so much fun. Very exciting. Yeah. So we have to wait outside. We're not allowed inside, unfortunately. It's a shame because Sophia keeps telling me Baloo's in there. I know, <laughs> not Baloo, Blue. Blue, like the bare, ne bare necessities? No, Blue, B-L-U-E. Oh, Blue. Do you know Blue? I but hopefully we can find a decent spot somewhere around the comedy carpet outside the tower um, and yeah give you guys some good action This one is. No, but she's got a, a brilliant voice. I really like it. I'm gonna have a look one again. Yeah, we don't seem to know anything about anyone. Like past two thousands. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the one before I knew quite a lot of the songs. Okay, so this one is a new album. I recognise. And um, this one is. Please, all rise for Blue. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
So we're just outside North Pier getting some fish and chips, which was recommended by our friends over at the Three Mouseketeers UK. Go check them out. Go check out their vlog of tonight as well, because they were inside. Yeah. We, were, we were outside. You guys were inside. We were, we were chilling with blue. Chilling with blue. We, we were there, weren't we? All these kids were looking at us going, what are you doing, Mark? Oh, no. no idea who, who they were. <laughs> it was great. Oh, I yeah. loved it. We literally, yeah, we literally said the same thing outside, didn't we? Like, we knew who Blue were and, like, no one else knew. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy, but every other one was in there. And we were like, uh, yeah. who's this? Yeah. <laughs> we like them, but who is it? <laughs> yeah. So you, you guys have got Three Mouseketeers UK yep. over on YouTube. Yep. But you're also pretty big over on Instagram, aren't oh, you? Oh, yes. Tell yeah. us about the gram. Well, you, we've got the Three Mouseketeers UK, and we also have mine, which is doing quite well, the Unicorn Mummy. Yeah. So, yeah. We're going to plug the shop as well. We've got the bearded unicorn as well. So, Excellent. Yeah. Put the plugs in there. Have we got anything else? <laughs> uh, we've got like five or six other ones we don't use. You've got the dad blog. Oh, the dad blog. You hardly use that yeah, one. Yeah, I don't no, use that. Three Mouseketeers is that. Yeah, nice. <laughs> but check them all out anyway. Yes, I'm wondering if that shirt is a bearded unicorn. This is a bearded unicorn. This is our Baymax. And this actually says in uh, Chinese, hello. You can't see it very well. But oh, really? Let's it says zoom in hello. or something. Oh, yeah, we still can't see it. Trust me, it says hello. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, to be honest, it's in Chinese, so it wouldn't matter. Like, I wouldn't know. Do you speak Chinese? <laughs> yeah, it's cool though, isn't it? Excellent, excellent. And this is a pretty cool lounge fly oh, yes. bag as well, I must say. To my friends at Get Ready Comics. Get Ready Comics. Oh, yes. Go and have a look at their website. They've got some amazing stuff. And um, they've got pre-orders now for their Halloween merch. They've got a new Mickey and Minnie bag, which glows in the dark. Oh, it's so good. Go and check that out. And make sure you go check out all their links in the description down below. And a little surprise down the block. And there is the bearded unicorn getting some great shots. North here. As you know, reckon... our favourite place. Woo! We're having a vlog off. Woo! Look at that! Dual vlogs! Dual vlogs! This keeps happening. That was good fun watching the switch on for the first time ever. What do you think, Claire? It was so good. Like, I had a great mm. time. The atmosphere was great. The lights were amazing. I had a great night. Yeah, it was a great atmosphere. And even the three Mouskis said that being outside was better than being inside. Um, it's super late now, though. It's probably about 11 o'clock. I was going to go up and down uh, looking at all the illuminations, but it's like six miles long. And to be honest, I didn't want to be at one end and not be able to get back via the tram or a bus. So <laughs> I didn't fancy walking. It's been a long day. So during the week, we're going to come back. We're going to make sure that we check out all the illuminations. So stick around on this channel for that. But until next time, let's chip.